Okay, so today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can create your own um, uh, virtual console uh, CIA games. So this is a program. It's called Ultimate Injector uh, for 3DS. Uh, I'm going to leave a link in the, in the description uh, for my Mega account for this program. Um, so first, uh, we'll start off with the uh, games that I'm going to do. So I'm going to do Castlevania Bloodlines and Zelda Four Swords for the uh, Game Boy Advance. So we'll get into the program, go File, go to New, and then pick your system. So first we'll do the Sega Genesis one. So Sega Genesis. Project, load ROM. So now you, found, you find where you got your ROM. Mine's in my USB. So right there, Cast of All Bloodlines. Press OK. Just ignore this message. It should load fairly quickly. There you go. Now to add a, a picture, the cover, you go to load image file. Um, so uh, Castlevania cover, press open. It should only take a few seconds. There you go. Now, fit by height or fit by width is the exact same. So I'll just leave it. And now for this picture here, for the wallpaper, uh, you go load image from file. Castlevania wallpaper. Press open. Just give it a second. There you go. So it's the... Uh, picture of the actual cartridge now go to injection method and that's what it's going to look like on your 3ds or you can have make it smaller or stretched i'm just going to leave it stretched so press ok now once you're done all that just go over to project export cia and then i'm just going to do it to my desktop press save it shouldn't take too long there you go, it's done. Press OK. Now let's close out of this one. Uh, close out of this one. No. Now we'll do another one. We're going to do the Game Boy Advance uh, Zelda. So, file, new. Game Boy Advance, uh, Load ROM, Zelda, A Link to the Past, Four Swords, open, give it a second, just ignore the message again, there you go, now load the image, uh, mine's in the USB, there it is. So, Four Swords cover. Open. There you go. This one looks better and fit the image. Now we'll add the background. Load from file. Um, USB. And then the wallpaper. And then open. Give it a second. And there, there you go. I think this looks really cool. Now go injection method options. This doesn't give you a um, different uh, screen you can use. So you got you to use this one. So just go to OK. And then go to project. 
export CIA and then to desktop and then save then it should do it uh, fairly quickly there you go now you can close out of the, the program close out of the program and you have the two CIAs so here's one Here's two. Uh, now you get your um, 3DS uh, SD card. There you go. So here's your 3DS card. Go to CIAs. And then just move them over. So there's one. There's two. So that's it for the computer. Uh, we'll get over on the 3DS and we'll install the games and see if they work. Okay, so now uh, on your 3DS, you put your SD card back in your 3DS, go to FBI, press open. Go to SD. Uh, CIAs, there's Castlevania, so press A, install and delete, yes, it should um, install fairly quickly, it's, there are small files, there you go, now we'll do the Legend of Zelda, Link to the Past Four Swords, press A, Install and delete CIA, and then yes. It's also a small file, so it shouldn't take too long. There you go. Press A. Now go back. Go back. Press start to exit. And now you should have two new folders to unwrap. There you go. So it, the first one's Zelda, so unwrap. There you go, there's that one. And now we'll unwrap uh, Castlevania Bloodlines. Unwrap. And there you go. So I know you can uh, download these virtual console games already, but I like um, adding in my own like wallpapers and covers. So. so there you go. So we'll start this up quickly and just to see if they load. Press A. This one's the uh, Game Boy Advance game. And there you go. Loads right up. Um, hopefully you enjoy the video. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. And on to the next video.